Yeah, hi everybody. This is Eric with Airplane Services in uh, Wellington, Kansas. Uh, today I just want to do a quick flight with you guys. This is a uh, Cessna 182. It's a 1977-182Q. Uh, this one had the 0470 engine, um, analog instrumentation, um, and none of the center stack here. So. Um, this is kind of our flagship airplane. Um, this has our IO550 um, 300 horsepower engine upgrade. And so I'm just going to do a quick uh, little demonstration here of what the uh, uh, what the takeoff roll, uh, climb, and cruise looks like in this uh, 550 powered Cessna. So I've already done my run up. Uh, let's get down here and take off. I'm put one notch of flaps in. And we have got uh, three-quarter tanks in the mains and no fuel in the ox tanks. And outside air temp here, it says it's 67 degrees. And we're about 1,300 feet uh, sea, sea level here. So... Wellington traffic, Skyline 182 Alpha Papa, departing on a 17, be a left hand turn out Wellington. So the vertical speed is uh, shown right here. Airspeed over here and altitude right here on the um, G500. So we'll go up to about 4,000 feet or so, level out and um, see what this plane trues out at. A uh, little more right, right rudder is basically the only difference, except for it's a lot more power. Alright guys, let's go. Fourteen hundred feet a minute. Let's go flaps up, and we're indicating about eighty knots. It's a little bumpy out here today. Keeping all those CHTs cool. This one has a. Uh, Gamey, gamey fuel injector nozzles in it. So fuel flow is turned up a little higher. So we're easily at uh, 87 knots indicated, 1,200 feet a minute. Beep. 78 knots, 1,500 feet a minute. So we'll ease the climb back a little bit. There's 3,000 feet, 90 knots, 1,300 feet a minute. See all the CHTs, the hottest one is at 364. EGT is nice and cool. Like I said, we have the fuel flow. This one's turning about 28 gallons an hour. Uh, Gammy usually wants those turned up a little bit. Typically it's around 25. Pull our prop back a little bit. Go to about 2,500. Little bumpy out today, guys. Those are cow flaps. Our 
fuel flow and everything set here. We're going to make this read about 70% power over here on our uh, EDM 930. About 23 inches, 2400, and we'll lean it back a little bit. About 17 and a half gallons an hour, and I'm flying this about 50 to 100 rich a peak. We're truing out at 152 knots. So obviously, we can push it harder uh, than 70% uh, 70, 70 power. But, uh, you know, I'm just out on a quick uh, test flight. I thought, you'd, uh, I thought I'd like to uh, take you guys with me real quick. But anyway, so we're burning, what, 17 gallons an hour, 70% uh, power, about 100 rich to peak, truing out at 155 knots. And I know if you push this plane just a little harder, it'll chew out about 160, 163 knots, and that is, you know, about 6,000 feet or so. We're already just about in the yellow arc here. Really nice airplane. This one we did a custom instrument panel. Had uh, Higginsville Avionics do the G500. Uh, the Garmin 750, 650, 345, and an Aztec 55X autopilot. Pretty choppy, Al. I'm going to go ahead and take the autopilot off. guys, I'm heading back to uh, KEGT. I'll talk to you guys next time. See ya.